hi beautiful people welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl again Niela Obijaku and we are back with another video so today's video just as the title says we are going to be chit chatting today and we are going to be giving a free makeup bag and ask to load it with five different makeup items which makeup items would it be so i'm going to be telling you those five makeup items and why i picked those five makeup items if you're seeing my face for the first time and you're yet to subscribe to my channel <laughs> i don't know what you're waiting for i don't i don't know what you're waiting for and i'm just going to give you a few minutes to click that red button that says subscribe turn on the bell so you don't miss any new video whenever it goes live on my channel Thank you so much for clicking that button and if you're an OG, thank you so much for sticking with me to this present time. You guys are the real MVPs. So guys, let's get into today's video. If someone gives me like an empty makeup bag and asks me to load it with five different makeup items, the first and foremost, first and foremost, the first makeup item that's going to be entering that bag is a makeup brush set. I don't think I can do my makeup without the help of any makeup brush set whatsoever. Be foundation, spoolie, powder, brushes, any form of brush. And the first thing that's going to be in that makeup bag is going to be a brush set. A brush set that is going to contain, has to include 10 to 12 basic makeup brushes. It has to include powder brush, it has to include foundation brush, it has to include a spoolie for my brows. It has to include an angle brush for my brows to help me define and sculpt my brows. It also has to include two flat makeup eyeshadow brushes. Why do I say two? Because... I can use one for lighter colors and I can use the second one for darker colors. So powder, foundation, spoolie, angled brush, two eyeshadow brushes. Then I also have an eyeshadow blending brush. I have a fan brush, you know. We have to apply the glow in, in a very cool manner. And the blush brush. So this blush brush for me not to apply blush because I'm not really a fan of blush but to help me you know apply my contour very well because most times most blush brushes always comes like in a slanted you know it's always slanted or tilted slanted to one side apart from the real techniques brush and i know some other people or some other makeup brands have been doing their blush brushes like real techniques so i think that's basically it and maybe one other generic brush maybe i could use that to contour the sides of my nose and also apply highlighter so that is one the second item that is, i'm going to be throwing into the makeup bag has to be an eyebrow gel because it's going to make me worry less about my eyebrows you know i could go about with my day even with in a very humid weather without worrying you know if my eyebrows are going to clean off you know because of the heat or because i mistakenly you know wipe or try to clean my face you can't be going out without eyebrows yes even if i know for me you know i want set fine girls to get even if i'm not wearing like a full makeup i should be able to do my brows really well and step out of the house so eyebrow gel is really important then then the third makeup item that is going to be in that bag that is very 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 important is a nude lipstick i'm a fan of nude lipsticks and i can as well do anything with nude lipsticks i can decide to blend them with um different shades of lip pencil i can decide to blend them with you know like my brow pencil so my nude lipstick so that is three the fourth makeup item that's going to be going into the makeup bag is my powder so for powder i have to go with like a powder that has like a full coverage not really like a full coverage but something that is also lightweight and also give a reasonable amount of you know coverage on my face and the fifth <laughs> and the fifth and final <laughs> i would want to also throw into the makeup bag will be black gel liner guys the reason why i picked black gel liner is i could use one stone to kill two birds so for black gel liner i can use it to line my lids and i can use it to line my waterline as well talk about killing two birds with one stone <laughs> so guys those are my five 
makeup items that i could just easily throw into a makeup an empty makeup bag if i was giving personal brush set um an eyebrow gel a powder a black gel liner and also a lipstick so but my lipstick preference will have to be nude lipstick i am also tagging or challenging anyone out there okay maybe not challenging because this challenge you don't do too much i'm tagging anyone out there if you've watched this video and you're inspired you can also create your own video this video was actually inspired by a post i did december 2017 on one of my instagram page and i'm going to pull like a a screenshot of it to tell you that sometimes most of your video inspiration can come from you know posts or written posts you've done in the past maybe on facebook or on instagram or on twitter i'll see you guys in my next video do have a fabulous day ahead guys don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it do have a fabulous fabulous day ahead guys bye p.s i've been carrying this makeup for over eight hours now and i didn't do any form of touch up i I, I literally don't do touch-ups because I don't go about carrying makeup in my handbag.